example of functions which are not polynomials. So I'll give you a graph of some functions which are not polynomials and with that I'll also explain you the characteristics of polynomial graphs. And after giving you the graph we can also write down their equations, correct? That's the whole idea. Now if I draw a graph of function like this which you know is an absolute function we know this is not a polynomial. Reason is that it has a corner, right? So it is not a polynomial and it, the reason is corner. Polynomials do not have a corner and it looks like a function which could be written as absolute x, right? So absolute x is not a polynomial. Now we have a function like this which looks like a square root function, right? So we can write this as function as square root of x and we know this is not a polynomial since it is not continuous in the entire domain. So the domain is restricted. Now we'll take another function which is kind of a sine function, right? So let me let me just let me just draw from anywhere. Okay, it's it is like a sine function, right? Now here the domain is not restricted, but the range is restricted, right? And therefore it is not a polynomial, right? If I want to write this as a function, well, it because I've drawn like this, I will write this as f of x is minus cos x. Okay, so that is not a polynomial. Now the other functions which will not be a polynomial will be the functions which are like exponential functions. Like for example, we have a function like 2 to the power of x, right? So if I write f of x equals to 2 to the power of x, here we have a horizontal asymptote, right? Polynomials do not have horizontal or vertical asymptote. Okay, so we can draw many more functions which are not polynomials. Let me sketch some more here, right? So I'll just do four more here. Well, you can always add to this list of functions which are not polynomial, right? So let me take up a function which has got both horizontal and vertical asymptote, and that is a function like 1 over x, right? So we know it has asymptotes. That is why it is not a polynomial, and the function here is f of x equals to 1 over x, right? Now, these are the type of functions which are not polynomials. We can have logarithmic function also like this, right? So that is f of x equals to log x. And it has a vertical asymptote, a restricted domain, right? So, so one reason is vertical asymptote. And the other is restricted domain. Therefore, it is not a polynomial, correct? So we could have a function which is a cube root of, cube root is not a polynomial, which will be kind of like this. It is looking like a cubic function, but it is not really a cubic function. This function which we have drawn here is cube root, which is f of x equals to cube root of x. It is not a polynomial since the degree is not a whole number, right? This is x to the power of 1 over 3. Now the degree of this function is not a whole number and it's not a polynomial. It looks like a cubic function but really it is not a cubic function, right? So when you look at it, it does look like a cubic function. Now we could have a function which is kind of f of x equals to x to the power of 2 over 3, right? So that is also a radical function which will have a cusp or a corner, right? So at 0 it is 0 may be like this. Now this kind of a function will have a cusp here, right? So this function is also not a polynomial. Polynomials do not have cusp or corner. So from these examples you can see a wide variety of functions which are not polynomials. So what are polynomials? Polynomials are 
if you graph them, they are smooth curves and their end behavior is that they are approaching infinity, both sides. So it could be plus infinity, plus infinity, or from plus to minus infinity, or a decombination, right? If it is an odd degree polynomial, then there is no restriction on the range. But if it is an even degree function, poly or even degree polynomial, then we may have, we will have restriction on the range. It will have either a maximum or an absolute minimum. So it is bound on one side only. It is not bound on both the sides. Sine function you see is bound on both the sides, right? So these are the ways in which we can figure out whether the given function is a polynomial or not a polynomial. But this is a good list to look at and I think it covers most of the functions which are not polynomials. I hope that helps. Thank you.